Yaki Niku for one person only. Yaki Niku like. Samurai Junjiro Channel. Hi, I'm Samurai Junjiro, born and raised in Japan. This video introduces Yaki Niku like. A yakiniku restaurant for one person only. It's a very popular restaurant that recently opened in Japan. I'll be eating a lot of classic and rare meats, so please stay tuned. Now, let's get started. Ah, uh, I'm all alone and bored. Akane Maru has gone to the beach with her friends. I'm hungry even when I'm alone. The yakiniku I had at Gyukaku the other day was so good. I want to try that short rib, karubi, again. But I can't go to the yakiniku restaurant by myself. Oh, I know. There's yakiniku restaurant for just one person. So let's go there. I'm here by train. I'm in Ueno, Tokyo. It's one of the busiest cities in Tokyo with lots of stores and companies. It's only a train ride from Narita Airport, so it's easy to get to. There is also a zoo in Ueno where you can see pandas. That's why there are so many panda products in town. It's a cute panda! The panda is eating Ichiran's ramen. It's so cute. Oh, I know. I'll introduce Ichiran's ramen to you next time. Please look forward to it. Here I am at the restaurant. This is Yakiniku Like, a place where you can eat delicious Yakiniku alone. For camera reasons, the lights are shining but they are not really flashing. Yakiniku Like opened its first store in 2018 and now has 50 locations in Japan. They've also opened about 10 stores overseas, mainly in Asia, so maybe one day they'll open in your country too. Let's go inside the store. This is what the store looks like. The counter is the main seat. So you can enjoy yakiniku privately by yourselves. There are also seats for two, so it's safe even if I come with Akanemaru. You can order from the touch panel. There is also a set of Japanese black beef. I can't decide, but I want to eat a lot. So, let's get the set that includes five kinds of meat. I'll have the Japanese black beef too if I can get it. This is what the seat looks like. So, this is your very own roaster. I can't wait. Chopsticks and hand towels are in the drawer under the desk. Drink some water and wait for your meat to come. It's nice to have your own personal water dispenser. Here comes the meat. It's a gorgeous set menu with five kinds of meat. The fire will ignite when you press these two buttons. Let's start grilling the meat. Let's start with the beef ton. Let's grill three pieces. Let's put some lemon juice in it before we cook it. Let's turn it over. 
Okay, that's good. I like to eat a lot, so I'll eat three at once. It's got just the right amount of fat and a nice crunchy texture. Kimchi is also included. It's an easy to eat kimchi with little spiciness or sourness. Next, we'll have the meat called misuji. It's a rare part behind the cow's shoulders. Let's grill it. Let's turn it over. It's got a nice color. Let's eat this meat with a strong soy sauce flavored sauce. It's cooked. It's got just the right amount of fat and it melts in your mouth. Let's eat with rice. The sauce is soaked in the rice so I can eat it endlessly. Next, let's cook this meat. This is the intestines of a cow. It's seasoned with sweet and spicy miso. Let's turn it over. That's about it. Let's eat it with plenty of sauce. The plump inner's hormone are juicy and full of fat. It comes with wakame seaweed soup. The gentle taste of the wakame soup goes well with the strong flavor of the yakiniku meat. Let's try this meat next. This is a classic karubi at Yakiniku. It's beautifully colored meat. Let's turn it over when it's cooked. The fatty karubi has a strong meat taste and is delicious. It goes well with rice. Let's add egg topping to rice. Let's break the egg first. I'll put the green onions and seaweed seasoned with salt on the rice. Put the yolk on it. It's a beautiful color. Pour some soy sauce on it, mix, and eat it. The yolk and creamy rice goes well with soy sauce and salted green onions. I can eat a lot of meat too. Next up is this meat. It's called Takumi Karubi and it's thicker and more satisfying than the karubi I just had. Let's grill it. I can't wait for it to be cooked. This is about right. Those juicy karubi with just the right amount of fat go well with the sauce of soy sauce. I can still eat some more. Okay, let's order the Japanese black beef set too. Here it comes. It's the yakiniku set with Japanese black beef karubi and harami. It's a high-grade meat with a lot of fat in it. The meat is so shiny. Let's grill it up. Let's start with the harami. And also the black beef karubi. 
Harami is the meat from the diaphragm of the cow. Let's turn it over. Can you smell the good aroma of the meat? That's about it. Harami has less fat, so you can enjoy the natural flavor of the meat. Let's try the black Japanese beef karubi. The fatty meat just melts in your mouth. It's so delicious. It's so good, you can't stop eating. The yakiniku that I ate alone was also delicious. Next, let's invite Akanemaru. Well, this time, in this video, I introduced Yakiniku Like, a yakiniku restaurant for one person only. But how did you like it? Was there any yakiniku that you wanted to eat? If there's a dish you liked, or a restaurant you'd like to see introduced in the future, please leave a comment. There are still a lot of great restaurants in Japan that you don't know about, so I'll introduce them in another video. Well, that's it for today. See you in the next video. Samurai Junjiro Channel introduces Japanese culture and more. I will continue to introduce a lot about wonderful Japan, so please look forward to it. If you have any comments, please write them in the comment section. I would be happy if you could share it with everyone on SNS. Also, please subscribe the channel and press the like button.